Hello, hello everybody, and welcome to a game showcase. This is a game by an old high school friend of mine, uh, which gives me even more motivation to play it, despite the fact that it is actually a pretty well put together game, and you're going to see that here shortly. This is Gone Wandering, uh, and the description for the game is pretty straightforward. It's a girl, a boat, and a whole lot of butterflies, uh, and I'll kind of explain that as we go along. It's a very relaxing game. Uh, it's a collectible type game where you just collect butterflies. It's really the extent of the game. There are some puzzle elements to it. Uh, there's a lot of exploring. If you enjoy open world boat experiences, uh, then this is a game for you. But it's pretty straightforward. Uh, you have this boat. You have this girl. Uh, you have this little guy on the back of the boat. I don't know if you can see him right here. He's got a hat on. I'll try to spin him around so that you can see him here. Uh, and then also make all of you simultaneously puke at one time. There he is. Okay, you can kind of see him. He's pretty cute. Okay, well, maybe not. Uh, but here's a butterfly. We can pull up our net like this, and we can just kind of drive on towards him. And boom, we collected him. So now we can look in our journal just by pressing escape if you're playing mouse and keyboard. Uh, and you'll see that we have caught one butterfly. I'm not positive how many butterflies there are. Uh, but as you can see, there's quite a few over here. So we're just going to come over here and grab these guys, uh, and add them to our collection here. So just kind of drive through. We got a couple. We got that guy. This guy, uh, yeah, he was a little high, but you know what? We got him. And then we also got these three guys. If we just skirt around here. Okay, apparently not. That guy didn't want to be caught. I can accept that. This guy literally is running away from me. Apparently, I cannot land shark the boat either. It's probably for the better, but... Is that stuff all the way out there? Are we going to have to make a journey all the way out there in a little bit? There's a small chance I may have to. Uh, I'm probably going to do some cuts in this video. Just... Oh my god, this butterfly is going to be the death of me. Uh, I'm probably going to do some cuts in the video just to... Oh, you son of a gun. Uh, just to get to certain areas since it's a pretty big map and you can spend a lot of time boating through. I've already played a little bit of it just to kind of get the hang of what's going on. I'm not going to try to collect all of them. I'm just going to collect a couple. Uh, does it actually... Okay, yeah, 13 butterflies caught. I figured that it might just be types of butterflies since they're different colors, but I guess not. We got a cute little fishing rod right here. We got some green guys. We'll try to get a green guy. But you can kind of see, this is really all there is to the game. Uh, and I know that a lot of you are probably going to be like, Wow, uh, pretty lame. That's a pretty crappy game. But there's something about, I've always enjoyed in games, just doing something relaxing, boating around, exploring a wide open world. It's got everything that I enjoy. It, it also crashing boats, apparently. But it's got everything that I enjoy in a basic little game like this. And I think that it has... Uh, some charm to it that, for being the first game that uh, my friend has put out, at least to my knowledge, uh, it's a pretty cool one, and I like it a lot. So you know what? I'm going to make a quick cut here. We're going to head over to Lighthouse Land over here and see if there's anything we can explore. I see a giant bridge, and I do like bridges, so I will catch you guys there. Okay, well, it looks like we've got some yellow butterflies here. We'll grab them. Why not? If I can get 50 butterflies by the end of this video, I'm going to deem that a pretty big success. Uh, we got some random water balloons floating in the water. They're probably not water balloons, probably just little buoys, but you know what? Uh, that's neither here nor there. I know that these areas have some puzzle elements to them, so I don't know if there's something I should be doing here, or if I should just uh, go on through and see what I can find. I see a little gazebo, pretty cute. Uh, we, we cannot land shark our boat. I would love to go in the gazebo, but Princess Peach here gets a little PO'd when we try to slam our boat into the uh, land. I don't know if there's anything to see here. I do see a giant like prison out that way. Maybe we'll go that way next uh, and see if there's anything to find there. But I kind of want to skirt around here and just see if there's anything to see. There's got to be some kind of butterfly over here, right? This ain't just here for decoration. We'll go around the backside here. I see a little dock. Maybe that means uh, 
we can do something over here. There are some yellow butterflies, okay. We can collect some of them. Uh, but otherwise, I'm not seeing anything too special here. So we'll grab some of these guys. Uh, I'm going to make my way out to that huge prison type thing. Just because that looked pretty neat. So I will catch you guys in 62 years when the boat finally gets there. Okay, we're slowly approaching Alcatraz here. And from what I can see right now, uh, there's nothing here. So we're going to go around this bad boy. It looks like there's stuff on the inside. The game also decided to just glitch out of my computer, so that's good. Uh, but... Let's try to just skirt around the outside. Maybe there's an entrance on the back side of this guy. And then that'll allow us to get inside. Because there's definitely something inside. I'm just not sure what. There's a little island out that way too. Uh, let, come on. There's got to be an entrance, right? No entrance. No entrance. Maybe we have to do something somewhere else to unlock an entrance here. And then in here is the final boss, the world's giant biggest butterfly. Maybe? Probably not, huh? Is there an entrance here? Still no. Or is there? Is this an entrance? This is definitely an entrance, right? Oh yeah, this is an entrance. Okay, so we gotta thread the needle. Thread the needle, he's done it. Okay. Solid. I see a big green butterfly. How the hell do we get him? <laughs> uh... We definitely can't just, like, put up our net and get them, right? No, 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 okay. Uh, let's... Can we just ram ourselves into the tree in the middle? Will that, like, spook them? Let's try that. Full steam ahead. Okay. Did that do anything? Oh, yes, it did. It actually did do. Okay. It did do, exactly. Oh, we got green guy. Oh, and she is pumped about it, too. Uh, she's missing her arm, but you know what? That's not important. Did that do anything special in our uh, journal here? Let's see. Oh, it did. Okay. So there's three other special butterflies, I guess. Well, now, I I'm a man on a mission, honestly. Uh, I need to find me some special butterflies if I can ever get the hell out of Alcatraz. So that's good. Where do you think the other special uh, butterflies are? That's a good question. Uh, this big giant obelisk in the middle probably seems like a pretty good place to start. So I'm going to get us close to there, uh, and then I'll be right back. Okay, well we're at obelisk land here, uh, and there appears to be a ladder to get onto the island, even though I know we cannot. That's a nice little detail ad right there, but the question is, is there a butterfly here? That is special enough for us to take him so that our little girl can go Yahoo again and give ourselves a little collection guide in our journal. That is the question. We will see. Um, so far, this is just an island that has a huge obelisk on it. There's no butterflies to my knowledge, but I also have not explored very diligently, so give me a hot second to turn this boat around. And we'll continue to look. I see some butterflies over there, but they just look like some generic yellow ones. Not a huge deal. Uh, can we, like... I know we can go in reverse, but I think it's still going to be easier to just go uh, forward here. And just occasionally turn and take a glance. Maybe there is nothing at Obelisk Land. Seems a little sketchy, I'd say. Maybe there's secrets here that I just don't know about. Uh... But let's... I don't know, where should we go? There's a big part of me that wants to ride out into the sunset way back there, but I still think that that might not actually be part of this map. And in that case, I'm just going to spend the next, you know, 20 minutes of my life driving. So let's head over to Temple Land over here and see if we can find something over here too. Because this place looks pretty cool. Looks like there's a lot going on. There's got to be something special here, right? One cute little white butterfly or something. There's some pink guys over here. We'll try to pick up them. Uh, all we need to do is get close and then throw this guy up. And bing, bang, boom. Mr. Worldwide is a step in the room. 
grab all those. And I think we've already gotten 50 butterflies, so my uh, plan for the episode is already coming true. But we'll just skirt through this little hole right here. I want to look, you know, left, look right. Everywhere you look, I'm standing in the spotlight. But so far, nothing really kicking it. I do see a bunch of, like, capsized boats everywhere. I don't know what that's all about. I am going to... Oh, there's a white one in here. Look at that, boys. Predictions. Okay, come, come around. I'm definitely not the ocean man here. Why did you go... You Do I have to hit this thing to bring you out? Because that makes a lot of sense, huh? Is he going to come back out? He did not come back out. What if I did it again, huh? Hit you with the best shot? Still don't want to come out? Are there other chimes I need to hit, do you think? And then if I hit all of them, he'll come out? Maybe. Let's continue to look around the island uh, and see if there are some more chimes. Because then I'm feeling like that's probably a possibility. Yup, there's some chimes here as well. Okay. So this works. Try to just skirt your body into here. There's some chimes. She's not very happy that I keep slamming her into walls, but you know what? That's neither here nor there. Please find, like... It's gotta be three, right? Three chimes. Not two. She is not happy with me right now. Is he in there right now? He is not in there right now. Is that where we were? I can't tell if this is where we were or not. Let's come back in here. Is this the same place? Maybe not. L let's, let's hit these again. Oh, darn it. Okay, come back around. Come back around. He's right there. I see him. He does not want to come out, though. That's for damn certain. There's all kinds of chimes in there. He, he loves the chimes. I put it down. People are like, Tyler, learn how to drive. Oh my god. Learn how to drive a boat for once in your life. Okay, maybe I'm actually just losing it. You gotta be kidding me. There we go. Now, can we look in there? Is he gonna come out? I would like it if you can't... Are you coming? Are you gonna come to me? No, you're not gonna come to me. I don't know how to get that guy. Maybe that's something you guys uh, can play and figure out how to get that guy, because I don't have the slightest. Uh, that is beyond the scope of my imagination to figure out how to get that guy. Um... Where else should we go before we end off this game showcase? I don't know. Let's go this way. And then from here, let's go... I don't know, let's go over there. There's a bunch of red things over there. Uh, I'll make it over there and then I'll be right back. Okay, there's a lot of butterflies here. Uh, none of which look like the special ones. Because there's a bunch of them. Uh, but that's not the end of the world. Because maybe that means there is a special one. I see one singular guy right here. Are you special? Do I have to come get you? I want you. You're very pretty. Come on. Come to Papa. I've gotcha. Oh, she's hyped. She is so hyped. She's also... The boat is going out of control. Yeah, we got one. Hell yeah. Okay, well, you know what? Uh, two out of four ain't bad. That's not how the meatloaf song goes that I remember, but you know what? That is okay by me. This has been Gone Wandering. It's a pretty uh, relaxing game, just boating around, collecting butterflies. Uh, I have no idea how many there actually are. Uh, I'm sure that I could probably contact the dev and figure that out, but um, it's a pretty cool game. I kind of like it. I would love to see more areas to go to and i would love to see you able to get out of the boat and walk around and collect butterflies that way uh that would also be pretty damn cool but it's pretty good for a very basic and uh starter game i like it a lot i hope you guys did too if you did be sure to check it out a link will be in the description down below thanks for watching if you guys enjoyed leave a like leave a comment subscribe and i'll see you next time bye